Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economic events, charts and important levels on the Forex Pisami.com forum weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit ForexPisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome back everybody. Let's take a look at the gold market. So not a lot of things to talk about today. As you can see, volatility is dropping significantly on the market and range trading range becomes really narrow. The first conclusion that we could make is that we should be ready for fast action. So it will be either to the downside or to the upside, but it's uh, probably will show some acceleration, the breakout or, or out of this range. Maybe some external data will be maybe i don't know fed means publication something of that sort uh, but some something should happen and uh, usually when the market stands in a very tight range it out from that with some acceleration and with the stronger performance so something of that sort so you can see here is tight range small candles and then fast upper uh, fast out of this range so this is very typical it's just nature of the markets how they usually behave it's something contraction be prepared for common expansion. So this is uh, what we need to talk about this year. Uh, on the uh, four hour time from chart, trend still stands bearish market does not show any attempt to go higher, show our prediction, which makes us to be cautious on the possible downward breakout. It's because overall uh, reversal here stands, st starts nice, but market very fast has lost the pace, has lost the momentum up the initial reaction it turns to some sideways action. On the fall down from chart, it leads to some very narrow price action in these two trend lines. So probably we could adjust it them a bit, this higher. Uh, so, but still market stands in very narrow range. Also here on the fall down from chart, multiple bearish grabbers, minor bearish grabbers have been formed. So lots of them here. So first one here is two others. And all of them suggest some downward breakout. Uh, at least minor breakout on intraday charts, but it might be also just a strong breakout. That's why in the current situation, we suggest that uh, as we have some wobbling action, the most correct way to act is just follow the trading plan. This is always useful. So since we have this setup on, uh, on, daily, on, on, on hourly chart, OP target has not been completed. Market stands flat about it. Here's was relatively strong sell-off, which suggests that short-term bearish momentum still exists. And from that standpoint, we suggest that it would be better to wait and see when the market hits the OP target. Since reaching of the OP suggests that it will be some breakout, some downward action, simultaneously, that probably will be the downward action right here, right? So it will be more or less significant. And that is the actually the clue to the evident so uh, what i would like to say is that with this fast acceleration it will be easily um, identified whether it will be moving only to the op and reversal or it will be just downward breakout and the way how market will start action here will tell you whether it makes sense to take the position at the op or better to wait and do nothing so as you can see here the op helps us a lot and in general, of all this setup of this guard is cheaper to buy a potential passion. It's really a uh, good assistance for dealing with the current situation. So we're watching for a possible uh, bullish setup, but if we will get real downside breakout with acceleration, definitely we will not take the long position here. So this fact that we are waiting for that also should give us a lot of uh, advantage and uh, help us to understand the oral situation in general.